Hey, it's Joe Tabarga from WedheadPumpRepair.com. All right, I'm back with my boy, JC. What's, What's up? up, man? How you doing? Remember, coupon code J-A-Y-C-E-E-2014 saves you $10. That's right, JC2014. This video is dedicated to Pete and Colleen Garten. If you can change his last, I can change his first. All right, so here we go. We're back with another episode of the Pentar Whisper Flow WF28 series. All right, uh, and what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be showing you uh, the uh, inside look of the armature. Uh, Robert's going to give you a close-up look of the armature. Come on in there, Robert. And uh, Robert's going to give you a close-up look of the armature. People always wonder before they take apart their pool pump uh, what is inside of their pool pump. There you go. There's the armature, the motor windings. There are no brushes in the style of motor, so if you are an older gentleman or a woman and you're used to working with uh, DC motors with brushes, there are no brushes in AC motors. All right, so here we go. There is the old bearing you can see it's a little scorched uh, from being overheated uh, this is what they call the arm and shaft what I'm gonna do now uh, I am going to rotate the impeller and we're gonna move the camera real close in here okay go ahead it goes close as you can uh, keep going a little closer there uh, why not just risk it well you know, go there you go going a little closer and what we're gonna go try to do is we're gonna try to hear it in uh, we're trying to hear this bad bearing all right so here we go let's listen real carefully I'm gonna spin the shaft let's see if we can hear the bad bearing You can actually hear a little bit of grinding there. All right, so there you go. If you need a bearing puller, bearings and seals, or any kind of other parts for your Pentar Whisper Flow uh, pump, head on over to wetheadpumprepair.com and we'll hook you up. All right, thanks for watching. I'm here with my boy JC. See you in the next video. Colleen, peace.